Tapu Tapu Watea is my name. I am spread over 2,500 hectares on the island of Rayatea, also called the Sacred Isle, the Isle of Ancient Kings. My territory begins out at sea and ends on the mountain ridges. From the Teavamoa Pass to Motu Atara, through the lagoon and the bays of Opoa and Hotopu'u, all the way to the peaks of Mounts Tea Itapu and Te Orofatiu. I am home to a place of worship that is important throughout the Pacific. A place where the chiefs of old would gather to make political decisions, where kings were enthroned and where human sacrifices were performed. This place is called the Tapu Tapu Atea Mare. Tapu Tapu Atea peut signifier plusieurs choses parce que bon, Tapu ça veut dire euh, interdit, c'est aussi l'interdit, mais c'est aussi le sacré. Le marais de Tapu Tapu Atea, c'était le plus grand par sa croyance, par ses dieux, parce que c'était dit que Taharoa, premier dieu de la mythologie polynésienne, le plus grand, le marais de Tapu Tapu Atea a été édifié d'abord pour lui. By my size and architecture, I am the most important of the Polynesian Marais. More than 400 archaeological remains were found in my valleys, a priceless heritage left behind by elders that makes me a sacred place for all Polynesian people. Tout dans cette vallée d'ailleurs est sacré. En partant de la montagne, la montagne c'est Tea et Tapu. Tea et ça veut dire le passage. Et Tapu ça veut dire sacré, c'est-à-dire le passage sacré. Disait-on que c'est à cause de, de, de Taharoa. Parce que Taharoa était descendu du ciel, il avait passé son pied à travers cette montagne. Donc ça a fait un passage. En posant son premier pas, il avait bâti un marais. Et dans la mythologie polynésienne, c'était dit que c'est le premier marais. Donc tout ça donne un aspect vraiment important et sacré dans l'histoire du peuple polynésien. I am at the center of the Polynesian Triangle formed by Hawaii, New Zealand and Rapa Nui. Eastern Polynesia is shaped like an octopus, Tumurei Fenua, with Rayatea, the head in the middle, and its eight tentacles spread over the whole of the Polynesian Triangle, as if to join all the islands together. Pour pouvoir bâtir d'autres marais dans d'autres îles, pour marquer la puissance, il faut que les, les voyageurs, ceux qui partent de, de l'île de Réhéter, partent avec une pierre de Tapu Tapu Atea. Quand ils partiront avec la pierre de Tapu Tapu Atea, ils vont bâtir leur marais et en pierre de fondation qui vient de Tapu Tapu Atea, leur marais prend de l'importance. Et Tapu Tapu Atea était le lien de tout le triangle polynésien. C'est un peu le berceau du peuple polynésien. I am the sole witness of all the cultures on the greatest ocean on planet Earth. Like a bulwark, I have remained the origin to which all the peoples of the Pacific show reverence. In ancient times, the warrior chiefs of Rarotonga, Fiji or New Zealand would come to me. Thousands have crossed the South Seas and some hardliners still feel the need to do so today. Tapu Tapu Atea is the beginning of our religion and our history. We know that our people come from Tahiti, from Ra'iatea. We had temples Tapu Tapu Atea in Hawaii. On uh, Kaua'i, on Oahu, on Molokai, we had three tapu tapu atea there. So we know we come back and forth. Harme ratu et it mana. Te mana no ni a shuti yene pu. No te mea aja tu e wahai e e ro atara mea. Mau tira tapu tapu atea no te mea. Ua prahi o ye e te whenua moa, te marae moa, te awa moa. Ua ye whenua ritu i te yene. Poni nye tia to tatou e. E mpua to to no mi a Hawaii. Ua e noe. You know, there are a number of reasons why this place is so special. Um, spiritually, culturally, we are connected. Malama Honua, which means to take care of our island earth, 
uh, really this very special, special place. And our kupuna, especially our kupuna here in Tapua Tapua Tea, they, they knew that. They had these um, rich connections with their past. And I think for me, the newer generation coming up, uh, we're kind of in a world where we face losing that connection. And so that is why it's important for us to take care of this area and to malama care for our connection to this area. And I feel that us being here and a, a lot of the younger generation being a part of this, in a large way, we're now part of that responsibility, stewarding that relationship to continue that tapu tapu atea lives on. And it's not just something that you hear about, but something that is still perpetuated today. It's still being practiced. I inspire respect in my country and in the whole of the Pacific. I hope to keep the traditions alive so that the cultural values and the history can be passed on to the future generations. Polynesian culture has stood the test of time. I am Taputapuatea.